Hello, uh, ladies, jump boys, and girls, LMG here. And, sigh, sadly, we're back talking about Bethesda again. It's the gift that keeps on giving. I could just only make videos about this, and that would be a full-time job. But why, why am I in the tonic shop? Because as Bethesda's customer support, their website was actually leaking customers' information today. They bothered to get up a sale. Limited time only. Oh, best value. Yeah, that's... That's what happened today. Uh, actually, I'll give you a link to Yang Ye's video. He goes a little bit more in depth. Uh, but uh, customer support tickets uh, with the special edition, you know, they were fi they finally broke down. They decided to do the right thing. I was kind of proud of Bethesda. Uh, they were going to place those crappy nylon bags with the canvas ones they had uh, falsely advertised. So that they were going to do the right thing, even though they'd given the influencers, uh, Bethesda influencers, really nice canvas bags as well. But they were going to do the right thing. So everybody submitted their information. Uh, proof of purchase. Your address. Your name. Your credit card. What you used to it. Pictures of your of your receipts. And Bethesda had that up for the world to see. Uh, they really didn't get to it for hours. And the only report we have is on the forums. One, uh, one uh, community manager decided, Oh, we've resolved the issue. No, you kind of just really... And especially EU law is a lot more strict on this. Yeah, Bethesda, you just the gift that keeps on giving. Uh, so unfortunately, yeah, if you did submit a ticket for that or you submitted any information to Bethesda lately, you might have your information by from somebody else. Yeah, that is definitely a thing. But now we're getting to the main part where we're here for the uh, glitches today. All right, we're back in Fallout 76, which I've actually been having a lot of fun lately. But I'm going to show you how you can have some fun too because... A lot of the bugs and glitches in Fallout 4 made its way into Fallout 76. Yeah, I like the look on your face. We're going to have some fun. Because as you can currently see, I am over encumbered. To an incredible degree. But LMG, how can I fix that? I'll never get rid of all that stuff. Oh, but wait, little Timmy. There's more. Let's go to apparel. And if this is, you're going to have to make this. Make sure you keep a piece on you to be able to do this. Ah, uh, yeah, this is not fixed it. You want to have a piece of pocketed armor. Any piece will do. Can be even a low-level piece, etc. As you can see, our carrying weight... Pay close attention to the carrying weight. Right now we have 924 over 210. But if you quickly spam the E key, it keeps going down. Keep on it. Keep on it. And you want to go to about negative 30 or so, because anything you keep up, you pick up, might. A uh, special thanks to uh, PV Talk. As well, it brings to my attention. But you can find these videos anywhere on the internet. It's actually... I was kind of silly to think that Bethesda would have actually fixed some of this stuff for an online multiplayer game. Uh, how anybody can defend this, I have no idea. This is... Sadly, I've been having a lot of fun back in Fallout 76. And also, did you know... Uh, site Alpha, Bravo, and Charlie are all the exact same sites, like, completely... A lot of people thought they were, uh, Bravo was tougher than Charlie was the toughest. No, exact same copy and paste. So there's that as well. But alright, let's go. Let's go. Come on. You just kind of gotta spam it a little bit. And I believe this works on console as well. I can't imagine why it wouldn't. Let's just go back. You can just keep going. It doesn't really matter. Uh, much like Fallout 76. Okay, and you can see now. I can run. I can fast travel. Doesn't matter. And if you do just get disconnected from a server, or you do the game crashes, etc., you have to do that again. Uh, you'll have to get out your power armor to equip that. But just always make sure you've got a piece of pocketed armor on, and you're golden. Pick up as much as you want. That's my gift to you. Enjoy. I just did more for you than Bethesda has so far. But alright, we're also going to show off. Hopefully this works. We'll see. I could not exactly get this because I think I did it wrong last time. Let's see if I have enough to craft it. That might not be... 900 pounds. You might not be able to craft it. Well, you never know. Oh, I actually do have one. Okay. We're going to go... You need to put down an artillery piece. Uh, you, I think you can get this plant from Watoga. The Watoga station as well. Or you might find it randomly as well. You need an artillery. Because now you'll have this inventory here. So now we're going to go 
Uh, actually, I can let's see junk, because I have a, because I can carry so much. Let's put all this here. So that's that's quite a bit. Do I have anything else really heavy? No, that's good. That's four and four pounds. All right, now we're gonna go back into our inventory here. And if I don't get this right, it's either store it or you scrap it. I think it's actually scrap. Yeah, let's uh, scrap this. And also another funny thing, if you do it, if you do put all this stuff in the that artillery, uh, other players can see that stuff and they can take it. So kind of be careful on that end. Uh, but all right. And so now, theoretically, in theory, I now have more carrying weight. So you can just staff it as much as you want. Doesn't really matter. Yeah, I like your look now. So, right, guys, this is a couple tips for me uh, to get the most out of your experience. Well, it might upset the server a little more. I, I don't know. Doesn't matter. It's pretty unstable anyway. If you if you've done the Scorch Beast fight, uh, Scorch Beast Queen, you know what I'm talking about. But, all right, guys, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know also why if you're still loving Fallout 76, why it it's not all horrible, but. Good God, there's a lot of horrible. They also just leaked all your customer information. I don't know. I don't want to die on that hill. All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be sure to bring you more stuff covering the Bethesda Saga and Fallout 76. And I'll see you guys later.